talk too much about the British Boxing Board of Control at the moment because, I mean, some of the things they're getting away with is just unbelievable. They're trying to get away with it. It's just, it's just shocking. I mean, boxing can be a scummy business at, at, at the best of times. Uh, it can be a brilliant sport business, but as I say, it's a, it could be very corrupt and it's a, it's a scummy business, as I just says. Uh, yeah, so they'll be used to knowing that. I still, I'm still training every day. I train two or three times a day, barring training, running, going to the gym, circuit training, keep myself in condition. You know, I believe I can come back and win another world of title. A lot of people may go laugh, you know, you're too old, it's no chance, you know, blah, blah, blah. But fair enough, give me an opportunity and I'll come back and give my best shot. And if I win it, fair enough, you know, then I can retire quite happily. But I need to remember, you know, when I was suspended, when my licence was suspended, I was undefeated in my second round as world champion, so obviously I've got unfinished business. So I need to come back. Uh, and win another, hopefully win another world title, then then ret retire quite happily. So, so as I say, there's a few things happening. That that fight as well, David, uh, on the Nigel Ben show. I've been training hard for that fight, but there's a few things that happened behind the scenes that were very unprofessional, and uh, obviously the fight fell through. No fault of my my, my own. I'd been training hard for the fight. So, as I said, I'll continue to train hard and hopefully I can fight in December. But, back to the book. The book is a very interesting book. There's everything in it. Uh, even, there's a bit about the SNP part as well. How they say they would help me on return back from Scotland. And that didn't happen. The third round says it's now an SPS matter. When beforehand they told me to go to Spain, put in for an extradition and come back and the SNP party would have helped me. Which uh, which I lied. Very annoyed about that, still still annoyed about that. Uh, so as I says, I'll leave it at that and I will get back to you.